Did you know that most Arduinos have a major limitation in that it's only capable of setting output voltages of its pins to 0, 3, or 5 volts? But it can simulate outputting specific voltages to a motor using what's called pulse width modulation. By switching a 5 volt pin on and off 50% of the time, a DC motor will get the same amount of power as applying a constant 2.5 volt direct current to it. But this technique doesn't work when dealing with other chips that need to read an analog voltage directly, like an RC car remote. One way around this is to use a digital to analog converter, which is a chip designed to take a pulse width modulated signal and output an analog signal at a specific voltage. But what if you're too cheap to purchase a bag of chips from Amazon or need to hack something immediately? You can make what's called a poor man's DAC with a low power capacitor and a 4.7 kilo ohm resistor. The capacitor will smooth out the changes in voltages while the resistor restricts the current draw. In this example, we use a 1UF capacitor and despite the pin switching from 5 volts to 0 volts 490 times per second, we modulate those pulses to produce the desired analog voltage. 